a lot of the people who come and see my work are maybe of a generation that are a little bit younger and have a different relationship with race as opposed to like my parents. When I was born, it was a lot cooler to be a black kid as opposed to like, you know, in the 60s or like 70s where like it was pretty fucking hectic. So I feel like that is a big part of the work. It's like, it's kind of like the sort of reversal of like being like on top instead of on bottom in some kind of way. That's why I entitled the show, They Should Have Never Given You Niggas Money. It was about the whole idea of like, you know, being that I'm African American and that, you know, the stereotype for a lot of young black kids is like, you know, they kind of go the route of maybe sports or maybe entertainment, which be rapping, dancing, or whatever the fuck it may be. And then maybe not, you know, using the money wisely or, you know, there's just a stereotype of black kids like, you know, like to buy clothes and shoes and like gold chains and shit. It was kind of about that idea of, you know, what to do like when you make money from your art and like how you're gonna invest it back into it and buy. Doing installation, it's filled, it's like kind of like a direct conversation about the idea of, you know, what, what does a young artist do once they've kind of, market-wise, have been successful. But at the same time, I feel like, I just like to make shit that like makes me laugh. So I feel like, at the end of the day, if it's not something that's kind of like humorous to me, or if I don't find that it has like some type of comedic or undertone that's, that would make someone laugh, I kind of like rethink it. If it doesn't make me laugh, I won't put it out. Mm -hmm.